but it's finally corralled by Audis Tony. Everybody's going to get up so they can play. Tony rings a tray, and there goes the confetti from the zoo. Eric Thornton matching up against Xavier, Xavier Johnson. McGowan's. This one's off the heel, but the rebound to Terrell Brown. And a flush follow. Bound and it turns out to be a basket the other way. Now here, what we're talking about with Terrell Brown, he's a guy who just knows how to get position, and even though he's not a... Man-to-man -man principles have been followed pretty well, but those long shots that are bad shots, ill-advised, will lead to fast breaks the other way. 7 nothing run now for the Panthers. Hamilton. Oh, the iron kind as it goes off the rim, off the window and in. You mentioned Ryan Murphy coming to the game. He can score just under 11 a game. And nice, beautiful isolation maneuver by Xavier Johnson right there. But later tonight in New Orleans for the first time at the next level. And dealing with that success and being able to back it up is something that's key. And Popovich now is knocked down a couple. 1-3-1 oh, one, one one. That time Popovich did turn and look at the basket and was covered up. Here's Rich Wayne. Right on cue from downtown. Jay Heath setting up shop. Gets it back into Rich Wayne's hands. Heath. Count it. Good heavens. And three-point shooting. Shooting at a 28.6% percentage coming in. And they are warming up tonight. Here's a nice runner by Audis Tony. It has been a lackluster start to say the least tonight. But give Boston College some credit. They are shooting it well and in rhythm like that. Well, they, they have, they have not one down. Johnson with a beautiful delivery, dropping that dime to Justin Champagny, his first bucket. Johnson telling everybody to get out of the way. He wants to take Richmond. With a stop and go, and he drops the teardrop, falling away from the basket. Confused Johnson. That was a really nice job by Thornton, but I thought Mitchell's play was the key to that. But there's the one bugaboo for Boston College. They turned it over. End to end. And that's what you have to do. You cannot just throw the ball around the perimeter of the zone. Rich Wayne. Oh, oh, oh maybe you can. Who knows? Wow. What do I know? Another one. Yeah, Kulavali just could not reel that one in. Alley ooping for Popovich might be asking a little much. And on the way up, he's tied up. With the dribble or with the pass. Jarius Hamilton! What a first step. That was some burst. Jeff Capel was talking to us about. Well, again, this is nice ball movement, forcing the zone to move. And when you force the zone to move, sometimes it's hard to close out. And Jarius Hamilton. Chris Wayne, threw that one up from the hip, leads to a run out, three on one. Murphy will pull up for three. That's a big trip. The tie-up. No one really got an advantage in there. Champagne. Motors up the floor, feeding Murphy, turned down the shot. Champagne dropped it off. Koulibaly wasn't ready, and he picks up the loose change and knocks it in. The ball with that much time left if you're holding it for the last one, but then Boston College gave it right back. Champagne again, off the window. How about this finish? Knockout by Jarius Hamilton. Thornton trying to go crossover, but the ball was deflected, and it leads to this turnover. And there goes McGowan's. Yeah, I think that's Mitchell still down on the floor. Well, Thornton lost control of the ball, never regained it, and then he throws it away. That's McGowan's feeds Champagne. He played very well with nine points in the last few moments of the first half. Follows the coach shot and gets that one to go. Down cleared by Eric Hamilton. It's been a six and a half minute game time BC drought. And then runner off the window converted. High pick and roll, well defended by BC. Again. Gotta make sure you get your blockout responsibilities in the zone, though. Terrell Brown. Look at that. This kid is everywhere. That's just a silly foul. Yeah, he's had a couple of them. First way inside the Popovich. Boy, his skill set is dynamite. He's headed for a 7 10 split. Well, they're trying to throw it to Hamilton. They missed him, but none of the BC guys was looking at the ball. 
I guess when you convert, though, that, that makes Boston College smaller on the interior. Oh, and this is a beautiful inbounds pass. And that time, Mitchell, just into the game, fell asleep. Where they missed Popovich again. He counts. But he didn't miss. Popovich is asking for the ball to be thrown over to the wing where they can throw it into him. Horton will take it. But Another he'll take three ball. He's only a 23% three-point shooter on the year. He is getting the job done tonight, though. All these Tony. Another offensive rebound. Offensive work forced him to the offhand. Into in, Tony to Murphy for three. And the lead is four. Popovich has a shot that he normally makes, but good defense by Hamilton, and Pitt is able to turn it into points. That's but good they don't get back on defense. I managed to get inside that stadium many times through the years. Johnson's going to take a three. Hello. How do you do? Yeah, he's been more a facilitator tonight with seven assists. 52-47 pit. Nice maneuver by Popovich again. Boy, are they happy to see him back. Johnson working on Popovich. Decides to give it to Murphy again. A step back tray. Oh, my. Now, this, Stephon Mitchell, what a great job to go out and switch off on Xavier Johnson. Oh, and a block to go with it. Loose ball. Run down by Hamilton. Mitchell went out there and said, wait a minute, I got him. Johnson tried to go around, but Mitchell blocked the stress shot and started that whole thing. Champagne lighting it up tonight. Champagne. Oh, what a play! Tony tapped it in the painted area. Career night, 15 and 9. He's on his way to a double double with seven and change remaining. Hamilton with a nice fadeaway. Yeah. The difficulty here for BC is there are a lot of guys now that are feeling warm for Pittsburgh, including Hamilton. A little extra pass to Stefan Mitchell on the wing. Not there. Great rebound. How about that? Mitt Hamilton getting the job done. Drives into a pit wall. Leads to another turnover. So he did get six. Heath comes away with it and drills the tray. The Hokies trailed for a lot of that game. They rallied. They won it a double over. Oh, oh, beautiful to Tony. This is almost a must score opportunity here for yeah. Boston What a move by Popovich. How about his skill set? Off the ball as well as with it. On the tap out, he comes away with it. Now they look to push. Hamilton. Nice move in the open floor. Up only four. Nice pass. Beautiful pass. And who better than Champagne to deliver the goods? If you're the Panthers, you've got to be tough with the ball. You can't allow, you can't wait for the referee to bail you out. What a play. Oh, McGowan's pass Thornton. Each trip so vital. Mitchell, count it. That cuts it to three. 24% on the year. And the old announcer, Jinx. That's good. Heath, by the way, three shy of his career high. Not there. Popovich fighting for it with Champagne out of bounds. I think you have a lot of time for fooling around here. Nope. McGowan's in pressure. There's the help. It's Thornton with the pilfer. So BC cuts it to two. In college, we showed you. That play where Pitt came and gave it, got a nine-point lead, and Boston College is down a back, and good heavens, they have the ball. And a steal. And so now BC with a shot opportunity to tie or take the lead. And they have no timeouts. Thornton all the way to the rack, and we're tied. Champagne, back to Murphy. He rattles it home. Four seconds left. Length of the floor. Survival, that's what tonight was.